So I quickly wanted to do this video while my daughter is napping since, as you know with the newborn, it is difficult to get anything done um, during the day. But I wanted to share my experience with breastfeeding and if you follow me on Instagram you'll know, um, unfortunately, it just didn't work out for us. Um, we tried really hard for the first three weeks and unfortunately I just was not producing enough milk to keep up with her demand. So we initially were supplementing with formula at the beginning because she wasn't getting wet diapers like at all for almost an entire day. So we did start supplementing. I spoke with the health nurse over the phone and she agreed that that was best. And as you know, when you start supplementing, it can be difficult to get your demand up at the same time. So I was pumping when we were giving her formula, but even when I was pumping, I wasn't getting anything. And as far as supplements go, I am still on thyroid medication and um, a lot of breast feeding supplements you're not supposed to take with hormonal medication so I wasn't allowed to do anything like that so I was trying to just pump and honestly when you're a new mom I wasn't eating properly I wasn't getting enough food I just could not build up my supply no matter what I did so I was pumping and also breastfeeding as well as supplementing with ready to feed liquid formula and after three and a half weeks it just I was so mentally exhausted and frustrated and upset and getting honestly on the verge of depressed that I could not produce enough milk for my daughter and she was cranky. Um, when I was breastfeeding, I, she was miserable. This baby was miserable. She was constantly crying. She was trying to cluster feed but couldn't because I was, especially in the evenings, I was not producing enough. She would struggle, she would fight me, she would squirm, and I just couldn't give her enough of what she needed. And even when I pumped, it was like half an ounce from both for like an hour of pumping. So we would have to give her no more formula on top of that because she was eating about one ounce, one and a half ounces, and then eventually two ounces at three weeks and I still wasn't producing enough. I could not even build up enough to put something in the fridge for the next feeding. Like it was constant and unfortunately it just didn't work out for us. And I was, I have been spending the past two to three weeks beating myself up over it, not being able to breastfeed or produce anything for my daughter. And I know there's nothing wrong with formula and I always thought that I wouldn't care if I had to formula feed, but honestly, I do care. and. It is really discouraging and my husband is totally supportive. He felt terrible that I was having such a hard time with breastfeeding. Um, she did have a good latch. She had no problem with that. The nurses at the hospital said she had a great latch. She doesn't have a tongue tie or lip tie. It's just honestly me and not being able to produce. And I, it's taken me a while to come to terms with it because I had always envisioned myself breastfeeding and nursing my daughter. I always envisioned pumping and having a supply in the fridge so that my husband could feed her with a bottle and it just didn't work that way. And I have to remind myself, you know, it doesn't matter how she is fed, she's not gonna remember it. And as long as she is healthy, that is what is most important. And I was beating myself over, up over it so much that I, it was consuming me. I was constantly Googling things when she was napping. I was constantly researching things and I wasn't enjoying any time with her because I was so stressed out about not being able to produce much milk. And you know, supplementing doesn't help, but at the same time she needs to eat and she needs to be hydrated. And the last thing I wanted was to dehydrate my daughter for my own selfish reasons. So she is content on formula. She is extremely happy. She is now, um, gaining some weight. She is still underweight for her height, but she is slowly gaining weight and she's doing good. The doctor has no concerns and she is doing so much better. And I just need to remind myself and other moms need to remind yourselves, you know, you just spent nine to 10 months creating this life. And you know, if you can't produce breast milk after it, that's okay because you just spent all this time creating a human being. And I'm trying my best to remind myself that, um, formula is expensive so that's another thing that's like oh I wish you know I could provide her what's natural and free um, but you know that's what 
that's all I can do and I know some people are gonna comment saying have you tried this have you tried that what about this you should have tried harder or why didn't you do this and I'm not doing this video looking for answers or anything like that it is what it is she is on formula she is happy I am happy I am no longer stressing over it anymore so I'm not looking for any suggestions or things like that I will be trying again when we have a second child I will for sure be trying to breastfeed and hopefully have a better experience. I'm thankful for the experience that I did have with her for those three weeks where we were breastfeeding even though it was a struggle and she was pretty much miserable, but I am thankful for that bonding that I did have with her. Um, but again, like if you're going through the exact same thing, I feel for you. I know what it's like. I know how hard you are, uh, how hard you're being on yourself right now, at least I was, and you know, you're not alone we are all going through it in some way or another and just stay strong because you know it does get better and if you have to formula feed then formula feed because in the end your baby needs to be fed and you need to be happy so you know you're healing you're going through all these hormonal changes to begin with you don't need the added stress of beating yourself up over how you're feeding your child as well so just keep that in mind again I'm not looking for suggestions like I said I can't do supplements I tried pumping we you know did the best we could I wasn't prepared to go on any sort of medication from it so we are content with where we are at and I just wanted to give an update on how it went for us and hopefully you can relate and you know if you don't agree with formula just keep it to yourself you know us new moms and you know second time moms too who just have a different ex breastfeeding experience than their first child we don't need any more criticism or stigmatism attached to it you know I feel I feel and felt horrible as it was I don't need any more judgment on top of it I did my best and that's all that matters and all that matters is we are now happy so that is my breastfeeding update. It's just a quick little video while she is napping. And please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do have some videos filmed that I will be posting. I just have to find time to edit them um, and just let you know how we're doing. So again, thank you so much for watching and please subscribe if you haven't already.